Do you want to boost your customer service and create your own chatbot? Well, that's a matter of clicks with Rebo AI. So let's not lose time and just dive into it. But before moving on, you will need to subscribe to our channel, put your thumbs up and not forget to enjoy our video. Think of Rebo AI as an AI-powered customer service agent for your business. It learns from your business data to handle customer inquiries on its own. So this results in cost savings for your business and quicker resolution times, leading to happier customers. So let's now train and design our own chatbot. So this is the dashboard of Rebo AI and here we need to create a new data set. We need also to name this. I will name this SAS space. So now we can see that we have four ways of importing data. So we have plain text. We can copy and paste there uh, any text in any languages. Uh, then we have document file. It supports PDF, doc, txt. We can also insert our site URL and you can all, we can also add some Q&A uh, probable questions. So I'm going to insert our site URL here and click add link and save this. Then I'm also going to add a plain text. I will name this contact us and I will copy our contact us page. here and create data source. I'm going to also add some Q&A, for example, what does that space do? We promote SaaS products, let's say, create data source. So now we have three data sources. We have their names and we have their types, Q&A, text, site, and also we have their status. So all of them are ready. So which means that we can now go and customize our application. After importing our data, we need to create our new application. So from this uh, button, we are choosing chat, conversational AI chat trained on your data. And we are naming our app. I will name it SAS space. We are choosing our data sets. In this case, we have one, but you can choose as many as you want once you have created them. Uh, and we are creating our app. So here we can ask him any, any questions that we have provided the data for. For example, if you remember, I have copied and pasted our contact us page. So I'm going to ask something about how I can uh, uh, contact them. So it answered in less than 10 seconds and also it provided a correct, it provided correct information. So it says you can send an email to infosasspace.com and they will get back to you within 24 hours. So also uh, provided some other uh, social media platforms that I can con contact them. So this is really good. And also let's now design our chatbot. So for this, we are going to our settings and we are choosing chat widget. And here we can first of all, choose our primary color. I will choose, I guess, purple, purplish. Okay. So here we can also customize our uh, description. Uh, so, um, for example, we can give our chatbot a name. For example, I am um, sassing, let's say. Uh, then we can also choose our title here. For example, we can again name this SaaS Base uh, Assistant. Or, for example, write, do you have questions? Um, and uh, we can customize the first message. I do not want in this case. Uh, we can uh, also have a bot picture. Uh, we can choose our button icon. Uh, 
So here you see, uh, I think I'm gonna leave it to this one. Then we can also uh, choose the alignment, whether we want it to be on the left side or right side. And afterwards we need to click on save. So once our chat is successfully updated, we can now go to share and see that it is just a matter of clicks, just a copy and paste, and we can share this with anyone. Also, in this embed part, we can see that uh, we can embed our chatbot into any website, again, with a couple of uh, clicks. Uh, we need just to copy our um, uh, chat uh, code and then paste it on the page that we want it to be displayed. And this is basically it. It took like literally under five minutes to create this uh, chatbot and uh, improve our customer service. We are done for today. I hope the video was useful. And if you still have any questions concerning Rebo AI, don't forget to drop them in comments and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Bye.